Between the cooler temperatures, colorful scenery, and reduced crowds, this is pretty much the best time of year you have to roll out your recreational vehicle. If you're looking to spruce yours up for a leaf peeping trip or maybe some tailgating, Jackie Denker has some ways to DIY your RV on a budget. We are stepping out of the house and into an RV to do some amazing design renovations on a budget. Just like most home designs, RV designs have changed over the years too. If you can find a way to make a budget-friendly change to an RV, you can save so much money and enjoy the process too. To show us how it's done, we turned to designer and realtor, James Judge. Starting with, look to change interior fabrics. One thing is for sure, oftentimes RVs have really busy patterned fabrics, and this can be kind of an eyesore and make it look so much more dated. So he says, change it up. You can actually oftentimes take off some of the cushions and have them reupholstered in a much more simple and durable fabric. He says, stick with a solid color and... I really like focusing on vinyl fabrics for a lot of the cushions because it's super wipeable and really helps to keep things clean. He also recommends changing out busy valances and blinds to something a bit more simple. A soft curtain can really make a big impact to still give you privacy, but it's less dramatic in terms of the actual patterns and can look great too. This is so much brighter. For James's reno, he did all of this for 536 bucks. Next up, fixtures and finishes. James got rid of his polished brass hardware and changed it up for some really beautiful matte black plumbing fixtures. And we also did low voltage lighting fixtures as well. And to make a huge difference, paint the cabinet. Cabinets. I picked a sage green color because it felt natural and when you're in an RV, you're out to see nature. So it really tied it in to help make it look super inviting and more updated too. And they decided to add stickers that look like tile for a backsplash. The stickers were a great solution to bring in a different color, add more texture. As for the cost, the cabinets, fixtures and finishes came out to $1,075. Finally, it's important to focus on the details. Hang artwork to really bring in some color and make that space feel like a home. Accessories in ways that not only look nice, but add functionality. Put a tray down so then that way you have a place to put things. And grab an ottoman. It can be a side table or you can put your feet up on it. All of these things have multiple uses. And whatever you add, remember Velcro. So it doesn't move as you're going down the road. The details cost James 172 bucks. So all of this was able to be achieved for less than $2,000 and the transformation was pretty amazing. We are on the road again with our updated and budget-friendly RVs.